Here is a brief overview of the ABC model of ABA. ABC stands for Antecedent Behavior and Consequence. The ABC model is a three-part system used to understand why a behavior occurs. ABC charts are used to provide solid data and evidence to support behavior intervention plans and functional behavioral assessments. ABC charts are an essential part of a student's FBA. One of the main goals of applied behavior analysis is to understand the precise circumstances that lead to inappropriate student behavior, identify the triggers for student behavior. And that's what behavior analysis is all about, understanding why. The broad definition above describes the ABC model as a three-part system. The first part, the A, stands for the antecedent. The antecedent is what precedes or comes before the behavior. Next is the behavior itself. The behavior studied should be a disruptive action. And the third part is the consequence. That is what directly follows the behavior. When conducting an ABC chart, it is very important to pay attention to the environment of the student as it often leads to an inappropriate behavior. Student behavior can be triggered based solely on the environment, such as during a certain class period or around particular students. Right now, I'm going to give you an example of an antecedent behavior consequence in play. Let's say that a classroom teacher just finished a lesson and wants to call a student to the board to do a particular problem in front of the classroom. The teacher asks our student to do the problem on the board, but the student refuses. The teacher presses the issue and the student follows up by cursing out the teacher. The teacher then sends the student to his social worker or case manager. Now, analyze this situation. First, the teacher asked the student to do a problem on the board. That was the antecedent. Next. The student cursed at the teacher. That was the wrong behavior. And lastly, the student was sent to the child study team. That was the consequence of cursing at the teacher. All this information should be provided in an ABC chart. With the ABC model, you are looking to collect data in an organized and meaningful way. It is important to provide dates, times, and incidents when collecting your data. With applied behavior analysis, the more data collected, the better. Be sure to get a record on all the details as well. Get the details of the student's environment. One environment may affect the student's behavior, whereas another environment may not. In the example given, it is reasonable to suggest that the student cursed out the teacher because he didn't want to be embarrassed. However, further details may lead to a different conclusion. So this must be studied. Right now, I just want to say thank you for your time and do not forget to subscribe to this channel.